Once in a while you come up with a product that just puts a smile on your face. Stay tuned for this episode. I'm going to talk about the five things I love about my power tank. I'm Jeffrey Douglas with SD Rover, and today we're going to talk about the five things that I love about my power tank. This is not going to be a technical video. I'm going to link to a couple videos for you that will show you the application of the tank. But I want to tell you this thing just makes me happy. So earlier this year in Anza Borrego, I came out with a friend of mine who has a new Deventer. And uh, we crossed over the crossover trail and had a great time. We had to air down because there was some, uh, definitely some washboard. And um, when we came to the other side and, and got to the street, I pulled up and decided to get out my ARB compressor to air up my tires. Many years ago, I had a battery blow up in my face, and any time I have to connect jumper cables or anything to the battery, it gives me a great deal of anxiety. Now, the ARB is a great piece of kit, and I highly recommend them, but um, Steve, uh, who's the friend, pulled out this black um, case out of his Defender, and he pulled back this tank, somewhat like this tank here, and uh, he started to fill his tires. And before I had the chance to get the ARB out of the uh, drawer system of the LR4, he was finished. So I went over and I said, what, what, what in the world is this? Now, of course, these are very popular with the Jeeps and stuff because they're running these big tires that do require a lot of air. Uh, and they have three different sizes, but um, I didn't realize at the time just how expensive they were. But when I got home and I did a little bit of research and everything, found the company, uh, watched a bunch of videos online. The owner's a really nice guy. He does a lot of off-roading. Uh, I'll link to a video that he's done on a demo of this tank uh, to let you know how it works. But um, I absolutely just love this. So I've had the power tank for about a year, uh, bought it with my own money, don't have any uh, affiliation with power tank, don't get any kickbacks or anything. This is just an honest review if you're considering buying this. And um, here are the five things that I think you'll like about the power tank. First thing is it's just fast. So while most people are on the trail side getting their compressors out, or even the ones that fill four tires at once, you can have your power tank out, set up, aired up, and be done well before the rest of the, the team. Secondly, it's just fun to use. I just look forward to pulling it out of my, my uh, rig and using it. Third, with the digital readout, it's very easy to use. You don't have to worry about what the tire pressure is. It's super easy for you to see. I would strongly consider you um, going to the digital version versus the analog version. Now, one of the things I didn't really think I would like that much is what they call the speed bag, which is what I had uh, shown you at the start of this video. It's a or ballistic nylon-like bag. It's uh, used by racers and stuff so they can move the speed tank from car to car. Um, since I don't have any roll bars or anything in the LR4, uh, it's difficult to fasten it down with a bracket and so I got the speed bag to just kind of protect it uh, when I keep it underneath the platform in the back area of the car and um, I thought that would be kind of a temporary situation but uh, you know I kind of like it now. It's nice that if I want to carry the tank to another car or another rig or if I want to pull it out it's super easy to pull out. Number five is quality. If you followed me on this channel, you know I'm a guy that would rather 
buy once and cry once. Um, so this has a five year warranty. Everything that I'm aware of is made in the USA. Uh, the shop is actually up in the Central Valley in Lodi. Great people, I called them a couple times. They were very responsive. Um, super duper quality. Everything is just top, top drawer. And that's again going back to what makes it fun to use in my mind is it's just a piece of quality kit. All right, well, nothing is perfect, obviously. And so let me give you a couple of downsides. The first one is CO2. When you go to fill up the tank, uh, you'll have to weigh the tank when it's empty and then you wanna weigh the tank when it's full. And the only way for you to really know if the tank is going to run out on you is to weigh the tank. There's no warning. It goes full on until it runs out of uh, CO2 and then it's done. So there's no warning. So you could be in one tire down and end up with uh, three tires that aren't. Obviously I'll keep my ARB um, compressor as a backup just for that cake. Number two, I live in San Diego. For, so finding a CO2 fill station is not that difficult. You can go to restaurant supplies with beverages um, for CO2. Some, some um, welding shops and stuff like that use it. But you do have to take the time to go to, um, to the place, get it filled, wait till they get it filled, pull off the tank. A lot of uh, places that I found in San Diego don't really want to mess with it. So they just, uh, they said it would be like two weeks to fill it. I did find a place down uh, south of me that does it, uh, does a great job. Uh, the last thing is the tank does need to be certified every five years before you can get it filled. Uh, I understand if that um, certification fails, the power tank will actually replace the tank for you. I would visit their website for more details just to confirm that, but that is my understanding. So in summary, would I buy the power tank again? Like I said, this tank just makes me happy. I love to use it. I love to have it in my car. I love to know at the end of a trip, uh, like today, I can, I can pull out the power tank and swiftly have the air back in the tires. So many times I would put off airing down with the ARB just because of the time involved and having to hook it up to the battery. Uh, no hesitation with the power tank and obviously in con convoluted roads and things, airing your tire down is, down is a great thing to do for uh, quality of ride. I did call a power tank a couple times uh, during the ordering process and also when it got here. Uh, the tip that was on it didn't work well with my tires. They were super nice. They sent me the replacement, didn't charge me a thing for it. Uh, very appreciative of that. Uh, very knowledgeable people. Um, nice to deal with people that are actually uh, overlanders or off-roaders as well. So at the end of this video, I will actually link to uh, the owner of Power Tank and uh, with a demo of how to actually do the tank, how to run it. Uh, I think he's done a far better job than I could, but uh, I hope that you found this useful. If you did, consider liking or subscribing. If you see me out and about, please stop and say hi. And remember, get outdoors.